Hello, everybody. How are you? Um, I guess everybody's getting ready for Thanksgiving. Uh, if you're having it at your house, if not, you're probably just um, getting ready to maybe bring something with you. Anyway, um, the craft I thought of for this month is like a little scrapbook. And I'll show you it here. This is it all done. You can see. And this um, cardboard is actually from the library. It's what we get the CD cases in. So I thought of recycling them. The CDs come in these little pockets and it makes a nice little book. So we can get started. I cut the paper out for you and um, this I stuck on, I, I cut it so that um, you could uh, stick it on the inside of the book and the edges. This is called washi tape. Um, and I hope I cut it long enough. I, I think I did for everybody to use. And I tried to coordinate the colors as best as I could. But I'm going to start with that first. And you could choose whatever colors you would like, but I'm going to take my piece of scrap. It, I think it's five inches by five and a half or a little smaller so that if you glue it, which you could use regular Elmer's uh, glue. Um, if you glue it, you're going to go over that like that. But I'm going to put the washi tape on first. So you just peel it off and it has a sticky side. And I'm going to stick it on just like that. And you could cut the extra off. But this way you won't see the white of the, the book. Okay, and now I'll do the other side. And it goes a little over the, but you're going to put the paper over that anyway, so that's okay. And I'm just going to cut that to the size. Okay, so once you have that done, I'm just going to cut this little, I have a little extra there. I'm going to take my um, glue stick. I have a glue stick here. And I'm going to take and glue the back of my paper, put it, you know, a fair amount on because you want it to adhere to the cardboard. So see, it covers it up like that. And then you don't have to worry about this because it's already done. And you're going to do that uh, to the next, to the middle and the uh, other side. So you'll do it to this, this, and this. And then you'll do this, this, and this side. And you can do it in whatever combination that you'd like. Um, I gave you, I think, six pieces, three of each of the same. So um, whichever ones you want to use to make the book, you put them the way you want. Um, so I'm going to do mine and you can do yours. And once you get that done, I will um, 
show you what's next. And this you could give as a little Thanksgiving gift or um, if you're going as a hostess gift, I just, you know, you could put pictures that maybe you have of yourself um, or you could just give it to them to fill with pictures that they have. So I did the inside of my book, the first three sides, you can see. Now I'm gonna just flip it over to this side and I'm gonna put my cardstock on that side too. Okay, so this is the other side. And you can see I didn't um, put the tape on yet because what I'm gonna do is close this book like that. And I'm gonna use the tape to do the edges here on both sides. So here's my tape and I'm just gonna Now you can let it overhang a little bit if you want to put it um, like to the sides. Like this. Let's see if you would like to put it on the side like that. And then you can just cut the excess off. Push it down a little bit just so it holds. Okay, and then I'm going to do it to um, this side also. Um, this one is, I don't know why it's a little thinner. I think it's just the way the cardboard is made. Okay, so once you have that done, you should have. Um, Well, your sides covered. You have to just snip that. There we go. Okay. So this is the inside, and this is my outside. So when you close the book, um. I printed out or stamped a little card that says give thanks because it's Thanksgiving. And you could actually put anything wherever you'd like. It doesn't have to be, um, you know, exactly the way mine is. Um, and I had a little piece of paper, but I, I lost it. So I am just gonna wait to do this, but this is gonna go on the front. And I, I think I gave you like a longer piece so you could put it sort of like that. I don't know what happened to mine. Um, I did cut it, I know, but I must have misplaced it for now. So I'm just gonna put that there like that you. Okay, so that'll be your um, outside of the book. So once you get that glued on, um, then you can do the inside. And the way I did the one that we used for a um, 
for the uh, sign up, I used it. I put the so thankful for you here. This is like a little peekaboo, so you can open it. If you want to write a message here, you can. Um, but what you're going to do is the piece looks like this. You're just going to fold it in half so that it looks like this, like a little card. And you can stick that in the side if you want, like I did for mine, where you would just put it behind the little um, cardboard because it holds CDs, it has a little flap here. And if it doesn't just, you can stick it um, on top, wherever you want. Um, I think I'm gonna put mine this way. And I'll stick a little glue on the inside here or outside, just so that it will stay. You might have a little bit of a harder time getting it back there, but there we go. So see, I put mine there, it's right there. And let's see, I have some flowers here that I gave you. Um, I should have cu I, I cut some for you. So I'm going to stick a little flower on the front of mine. Um, let's see. I'm going to put this one on. And then maybe underneath there, I'll just put this little, um, I can write a little note or I can put, uh, there's a little sticker here that says relax. So maybe I'll put that underneath there. Um, and when you open it, you can read it. Or I have enjoy, so maybe I'll, I think I'll use that one. That sounds more um, like they can enjoy the book. So see, I did it like that. Uh, then I gave you this little, it's a scalloped circle. So I put mine on the bottom here and it is holding a picture. So if you'd like, you can do that um, wherever you want. So I think I'm going to put mine right here. And that you can fill with a flower or I gave you some words I think you can put on. Um, I tried to put a bunch of stuff in everybody's bag. Uh, and then when you get your picture, you could put the picture right in there to hold it. Like I did here. There. So I have this little 
thing that says um, seize the day. So I think I'm going to put that right in the middle and then I can put a picture right on top of that if I want. Or you could put um, some writings, what you're thankful for, for the people. If you want to put a piece of paper in there or note um, a card, you know, like a little cut out from a note card and just stick that in there and say, oh, I'm thankful, you know, for you or the time we've spent together. Uh, let's see, I'm going to put that in the middle there. So see, it says seize the day, and then you open it and it says enjoy. And I have this that says, uh, give thanks for the simple things in life. So that I think I'm going to put here on my first page there. And I gave you some ribbons so you could make um, a bow and just fill some spots in if you'd like. And I'm going to take my ribbon and make a bow. And you can make a big bow or a little bow, whichever you want to do. You could probably make more bows out of if I gave you enough. So there's my little bow. I'm going to cut it. just stuck it on my that page right there and I can put a picture here probably and let's see for this one I have this little extra flower from the, the punch out and I think I gave you, I left it in the bag for you guys. I'm just going to glue. I like a lot of little things. My husband always says to me, you're always putting too much on, but that's the way I am. I like it like that. So this is it. And I hope you enjoyed it. And if you have other um, pieces left, you can do whatever you want with them, you know, dress it up the way you want. And um, I hope you enjoy it, or I hope whoever you give it to will enjoy it. And have a blessed Thanksgiving and stay safe. Thanks. See you next time. Bye.